What we're going to do is look on the computer where the uh, design was conceived and see how the column wheel and the oscillating pinion work together for the chronograph. Et est-ce que vous pouvez nous montrer pour le départ? Can you begin by showing us the start stop and the parts that move when one pushes the start stop? Exactement. Donc, lorsqu'on appuie sur. When you push the pusher of the watch, that moves this component. Oui. The column wheel is this component here. C'est, c'est rouge, oui. That's red. Can you give us a view which is inclined so that we can see the part that's higher than the rest? Exactement. Donc on voit ici les deux niveaux de la roue. You can see here that there are two levels to the column wheel. The level that works with the start-stop command and the level that works to program the functions for the rest of the chronograph. Et, et ensuite, le, la bascule. And next, the rocker that touches the column wheel at one end and the other end that works with the oscillating pinion. That's the rocker in blue, which moves according to the position of the column wheel. And now the oscillating pinion is where? The oscillating pinion is here at the other end. Oui. Et c'est, c'est un yes, it's a pinion with two ends. Exactement. Un côté qui travaille avec One side works with the movement and the other side with the chronograph. You see the part of the pinion that engages the seconds wheel of the movement. And it turns constantly. Avec le mouvement. Exactement. Et l'autre partie. And the other part engages the seconds wheel of the chronograph. La roue de seconde chronograph. Can you show us the seconds wheel for the chronograph? La roue pour la seconde chronograph. Exactement, c'est celle-ci. It's this one in blue. En bleu. And at the other end is the seconds hand for the chronograph. Exactement. We have an axis that traverses the entire movement and extends above it. OK, très bien. Et donc, lorsqu'on fait la commande... OK, and when you make the start command, can you explain how the components that we have seen work together? Les composants que nous avons vus travaillent ensemble. OK. Alors... When you push on the start command, the tip that you see here engages the teeth of the column wheel. Vient travailler avec les dentures de la roue à colonne. Et la roue à colonne. And the column wheel turns. And it turns clockwise. Exactement. Et lorsque la roue à colonne tourne dans ce sens. And when the column wheel turns clockwise, what happens to the tip of the rocker? La roue à colonne. Ce qui se passe lorsque la roue à colonne the rocker will move out to the edge of the column. Monter sur une colonne. Oui. Yes, and what happens at the other end? L'autre côté de bascule. Et lorsqu'elle monte So when it comes out to the edge of the column, it loses contact with the rocker that holds the oscillating pinion. Oui. Et donc le pinion oscillant bouge. And so then the oscillating pinion moves in a direction that has it touch the chronograph seconds wheel. Exactement. Et ça fait démarrer le... And that starts the chronograph. Exactement. Les dentures du pignon oscillant. The teeth of the oscillating pinion engage with the chronograph seconds wheel. And so when it's engaged, the chronograph starts. Le chronographe démarre. Exactement. Exactly. It starts. Mm-hmm.